On Brainiac, we've set out to prove that science can be fun. <laughs> Thanks, villains! But science can also be very dangerous. <laughs> that was your clothes! Especially when it falls into the wrong hands. The hands of this man. I give you Dr. Bunhead. Brainiac! They say too much of a good thing is bad for you. Take this wooden splint, for example. What about if you have too much oxygen? This is pure oxygen gas. It causes it to reignite. Not very spectacular, but what about if we take something a bit more concentrated, a thousand times more concentrated, liquefied oxygen, or what's known in the trade as rocket fuel, a freezing cold liquid. What would happen if you were a smoker in an oxygen-rich environment? Some cigarettes soaked in liquid oxygen. You would find your cigarettes burn a good deal faster. There's the tobacco burning nicely, and the end which is made of cotton wool. Or is it going to go? Woo! <laughs> a good deal faster than the tobacco. That begs the question, what if you were a nappy-wearing smoker in an oxygen-rich environment? Five, four, three, two... I think that answers the question. So what happens if you were a nappy-wearing smoker in an oxygen-rich environment, in a confined space, sleeping on a cotton mattress? That, that's it done. So I'm out of here. Sleep tight. Um, can't open this. Is it magnetic or what? I just need a, a blade or something just to open this. I'm not going to ignite it yet. I'm just going to get out of here. We have ignition. Um. It should go a lot more. Uh, it should go. Jesus! Burnhead survived this ghastly accident. Has he gone to that great chemistry lab in the sky? Tune in next time to find out.